dear students today we are going to learn the topic is called mealy missions we have the two state missions one is called mealy mission another one is called more mission okay so what is the difference between the mealy mission and more mission the input is direct if input is directly connected to the output then it is called mealy mission if you take the more mission in more mission the input is does not connect directly does not connected with the output decoder uh so that is the difference between the mealy mission and more mission today we are going to learn about the mealy mission in that mealy mission we are learning about the 101 sequence detector okay so i am taking the 101 sequence detector here so this is the 101 sequence detector so first i am writing the states okay first uh, initial state s0 is called initial state s1 is called 1 i am writing as a s1 is a 1 because of uh, first uh, here the number is a 1 so that's what i am writing 1 1 0 is the s2 state okay 1 1 0 is the s2 state i am not writing the s3 state because of in mele mission we have to stop here up to s2 in more mission you have to write compulsory s3 because of you have to show the output there that's what i am not writing here the s3 in mele mission okay so first i am taking s0 s0 uh, to s1 when it is going to s0 to s1 when input is 1 so when input is 1 it is going to s1 state s1 to s2 when it is going to s1 to s2 when input is 0 okay here any output is detected it's not detected that's what we are writing the output 1 is nothing 1 by 0 1 is nothing but the input 0 is nothing but the output okay so of three states are there s0 s1 and s2 if it is 1 it is going to s1 state if it is 0 it is going to s2 state up to now you are understood so now we are at s0 state s0 state to s1 state when one is detected then it is going to s1 if it is zero detected then it is in the same state that is nothing but the initial state okay if if so we are at s1 state and when it is zero it is going to s2 state if it is the after one if it is one is detected nothing but the one one you have so with one one any state uh, is starting with the one one no only with one only it is starting what is the name of the one here s1 so s1 means it is in the same state so when it is one it is in the same state okay i think you are understood now we are at s2 okay we are at s2 we have the two choices first choice is zero another choice is the one so after 10 if it is one detected then sequence is totally sequence is detected so when 101 is there any sequence is starting with 01 no the any sequence is starting with 1 yeah so what is the name of the one s1 so when it is one is detected nothing but the output detected that's what 1 by 1 we are writing and it is going to the s1 state okay when it is one after 10 if it is zero detected then 1 0 so any uh, sequence is starting with zero or 0 0 no so that's why it is going to the initial state that is nothing but the s not state this is the 101 sequence detector okay just we are changing the names and we are writing here s not is nothing but the initial state or reset state s1 name is the one s2 state is the 10 okay this is you have so got one nothing but the s1 state is nothing but we are writing as a got one got 10 nothing but the s2 state okay this is the same state machine um, we can represent uh, representing in the reset got one and got 10 okay now we are going to the code okay so first uh, first in mele machine first we have to write the code for next state decoder here we have the two combination circuit one is called next state decoder another one is the output decoder okay what is the next state decoder another one is the output decoder here only we have the sequential circuit that is the state register okay nothing but the flip flop first we will complete the module actually so module for the uh, state machine mele machine so module mele machine mele fsm we are writing so this is the sequential circuit compulsory required the clock and reset so clock and reset we are writing don't Come, uh, uh, don't say that RST and REST are same because of RESET is the reset is nothing but the state name. RST is the reset condition. Okay, RST so clock and reset condition and DIN is the input. 
depends upon the input only it is going to which state we are declaring that is nothing but the one or zero we are writing that is nothing but the d in okay so output we need the output so output is we are indicating with the register y okay this is the module declaration here i am writing the states different states are there parameter we are indicating with the parameter two bit two bits because of we have the states like a s not s1 s2 0 0 0 1 1 0 states are there that's what i am indicating with the two bit state so reset equal to 2 tick b 0 0 got 1 is nothing but the 2 tick b 0 1 got 1 0 equal to 2 tick b 1 0 okay this is the i am declaring the state names reset got 1 and got 1 0 and i am declaring the here two uh, output and input of the flip flop that is the present state and next state that's for that one i am using here two bits okay right now i have to write the code for first next state decoder this is the what is this one next state decoder it is the combination circuit okay so here we are writing this combination circuit using always block and we are writing in the case uh, using case statement okay right always at the rate of present state and d in so present present state and inputs are there that input is nothing but the, i am taking d in if these are changes then only the next state decoder will be works okay so begin case case so first present state what is the present state now so you here you have to see the first compulsory the diagram actually diagram is required so previous diagram so when now we are at present state so present state is the reset state when it is one it is going to the got one state when it is zero it is in the same state okay so that's what i am writing here so case present state when we are at reset state okay if d in d in means present state is d in d in means d in true true means it is one when it is one it is going to the next state what is the next state got one state Otherwise, it is in the same state. So else, else, what is the output? Next state. Next state is nothing but the output. Output is nothing but the. So now, uh, if it is one, it is going to got one. Zero means in the same state, reset state. Okay. Now it is in the got one state. What is the got one state? This is the got one state here. Got one. If it is zero, it is going to the next state, got one zero state. Otherwise, it is in the same state, got one state. Zero, next state, one, same state. So we are writing the code here. Got one. If D in is true, means D in is one. Next state output is the same state. Else output is the next state. Next state is a got one zero. So similarly, we are at got one zero. What is the got one zero? We are at when it we are at got one zero. It is zero. Then it is going to the reset state. Okay. It is one. It is going to the got one. Okay. Got one state. Right. So same thing we are writing. We are at got one zero if d in is one one means it is going to the it is in the same state so next state is the got one state else it is going to the reset condition so reset condition right default next state we are writing reset state so this is we are completing the next state decoder okay after that we have the we have to write the state register okay this is nothing but the memory element so we have to write the memory element. The memory element is nothing but the flip-flop. Flip-flop will be works here only we are taking the D flip-flop. Okay, flip-flop will work based on the clock and reset. So here we are using the posage clock and posage reset. Okay, begin. Begin if reset is true. Reset equal to one. Present state equal to reset. So what is the output of your output of your uh, uh, state register? Present state input is the next state okay so present it is in this uh, reset equal to one when reset equal to one it is in the present state is a reset state okay s yes, not state nothing but the reset state okay else else means if reset equal to zero then present state equal to next state okay right present state equal to next state so either it may be in the same state or it is going to the next state only two conditions Reset 1, it is in the same state. Reset 0, it is going to the next state. Only we are working the memo, uh, this uh, flip-flop that uh, when, it, when you are giving 1, it is going, uh, it is in the same state. When it is 0, it is going to the next state. Just only two conditions, it's work. Okay. So now we are writing the code for output decoder. 
So output decoder is also combination circuit. Okay. Here, if you see here, uh, we are using the case statement, always present state and D in. It depends upon the present state also. So what are the inputs for output decoder? Present state and input. Input is nothing but the D in. These two are there. Okay. Case, it depends upon the present state. What is the present state? We are at reset state. Reset state, what is the output? One tick B0 because of zero only the reset state. Only when you are after the going to the GOT10, in that also two conditions are there. In only one condition, that is the 101, then only it recognizes the sequence. That time only output one. Otherwise, the output is zero. Okay. Reset y equal to one tick B0 because of we are at reset. Output is zero. Got one. Output is zero. Got one zero. We have the two conditions. If D in nothing but the input is one, input is one, then only it is detected the sequence. That's what the output equal to one tick B one. Else output equal to one tick B zero. Okay, right? A default y equal to one tick B B zero. So case is completed, end case, end. Okay, this is the, after that you have to write compulsory end module also because of we are completing the module. This is the writing of state machine, a melee machine coding, right? I think you are, all of you understood. If you have any doubts, just ask me. Okay, uh, thank you.